As you may have heard, President Trump today called for bipartisan solutions for making this country safer following those mass shootings. And we'll have more on what he said tonight at 10 o'clock. But some local lawmakers and political figures we spoke with today are calling for support for those directly impacted. It was a horrible act. It is not tolerated in Texas. And this isn't political. This is people. So whatever we do, try to comfort those, try to bring healing, and let's be together. These two individuals targeted black people, Hispanic people, people of color. Um, and it didn't help that our current president increase the, how you say, racial tension with his racist rhetoric. We will have more tonight at 10 o'clock, just a couple of local opinions. We wanted to give you a chance tonight to weigh in on the possible ways to reduce the number of mass shootings. We're hearing lots of people talk about the need for tougher background checks before people could buy a gun. We've also heard from those who say there's no legitimate reason to allow people to have assault rifles that can take out dozens of people in a matter of seconds. But where do you stand? Do you think there should be tougher background checks? a ban on the private ownership of assault weapons. Should both of those options be put in place? Or should none of those options happen? Just go to our website, ktriplitv.com, and you click on the megaphone poll area, and you can let us know how you feel. We'll have the results tonight on 3 News at 10.